My name's Alex Chumpy Pullen. I'm originally from Mansfield in Victoria. Uh, currently based in DY in Sydney. My, the sport I compete in and have competed in since I was about 12 years old is called snowboard cross. It's been an Olympic discipline for two cycles now. And uh, I've been to one Olympics already, so I'm looking forward to uh, the next Olympics, which is Sochi in February. Uh, look, snowboard cross is a really great event. It's action packed, it's full of uh, of really exciting moves which, which comes based on it's a racing sport. There's no judging, it's down to the finish line. Combines pretty much all the snowboard skills. Uh, there's jumps, there's high speed, there's racing. Um, you, you know, the, these days we race six man heats and uh, plenty to take in. It, it replicates pretty much what it's like to just go out and do a snowboard run. I was born pretty much with snow in the blood. My family owned a ski and snowboard uh, business down in Mansfield. Um, really passionate about the snow and got started skiing with them at about the age of three and then my dad was able to get me a snowboard at about the age of eight or nine which was my height. Back then it was a really young sport. Um, I won the Australian national champs in open men's when I was 15 years old and I think that was the first real victory that felt um, like a real notch in my belt and you know my dad was there, he was waxing my boards, we just had a really good time and from there it's, uh, it's been a huge journey. A lot of time overseas, a lot of travel, a lot to take in, a lot to learn, but um, I think it's, yeah, it's become my life and it's certainly what I enjoy doing. Yeah, the first Olympics was great. I mean, as, as you can imagine, um, a totally different scene to everything else out there and everyone sort of always tries to explain the Olympics. It's really hard to do actually because it's just so huge and overwhelming and, um, and fun. Mostly for me it's fun. I mean, that's, it's got to be. Currently I've had two wins at the, at the last two World Championships. The second one, I mean, it was, it was better again, I think, just because of having that pressure to win again. For me, my next thing really is the Olympics, and that's why it's great to be at the level I feel that I am in my career and then heading in to the opportunity of the Olympics um, coming up in February. It's, yeah, it's, it's perfect, perfect timing. I feel, feel really good. I, I'm, like I said, I'm really loving my sport, loving the racing, loving the challenges. Yeah, look, the Sochi track is uh, fantastic, actually. It was the first time, my first time to Russia and first time that I was able to ride the course. And uh, the course builder there who's building and designing is David Nee. Uh, he's done a fantastic job of courses in the past on the World Tour. And uh, he's doing a really great job with the one there in Russia. And, there were some really big challenges there for me, but that's the sort of course I'm after. I'm really chasing a technical track. To make that difference between myself and other riders, I need as much of that technical features, um, even difficult conditions as possible. Uh, that's probably, you know, that would definitely will sit in my favor. So that's exciting to know, and um, you know, I'm happy we've all, almost only been there once. You know, a lot of the time, the tour stops through the tracks uh, quite often, almost you know, uh, once every season which gives a lot of athletes a lot of good practice on that course. Um, in my perfect world, we'd rock up to a course that no one's ever seen before and race on it day one. Um, that's where I feel I have my advantage. So given that we've only been there once before and only had only for a short time, um, yeah, I think there's some really good strengths for me uh, looking ahead to Sochi. And, and uh, apart from anything, it was, it was really fun to ride. Yeah, look, it's been fantastic being an AIS scholarship holder the whole way. Um, the good thing is, is that I see um, not only in snowboard cross, but in the winter sport program in its entirety, is really making some, some great gains, leaps and bounds. This looks like it's going to be a fantastic team that we send to Sochi as a whole.